thank you for having me on the show. Uh, I've been waiting for the day someone will interview me like this because I've been interviewing people on my own podcast. Um, all you need to do is search for the name of the language, tutorial or lesson, beginner tutorial, and you get stuff. You just get stuff. And all projects like a few weeks ago I released the version of an app on the iOS store even though it's been in the Android store since January please don't go and try to reverse engineer that one So, your level, how, where do you get resources at your level in terms of, you know, when you get stuck while writing code or, you know, facing difficulties? So, Dara. Mm. <laughs> so, if I get stuck, which I do sometimes, actually, most times, actually, um, well, the place to go is Google. <laughs> to be frankly honest, the first place I went to is Google. After I would have, of course, went through the problem to see what goes on. Google will lead me to Stack Overflow and maybe some Microsoft Docs. Um, so sometimes I get the solutions on Stack Overflow. To be honest, if you see the questions I'm typing on Google today, there are questions beginners would not be typing. So like how to do how to do HTML tag, all those kind of <laughs> very funny things is what I do. So when people think of we senior developer, it's not like um, it's the same sort of code that we write. It's just that we write them in sort of most of the case, but it's still the same Google things we Google with junior developers. How to center a table, how to center HTML. Those are the kind of things I Google to be honest, and I write elegant code. So it's sort of funny. Because it's still the same place we run to, but of course it takes. Um, so the only difference would be that it will take uh, a shorter time to understand the solution to the problem for a more senior developer than a junior one. So if I scroll to Stack Overflow, I check through the answers. I might, of course, know the one that worked for me straight out of the box without copying and pasting and testing out. So I might just have an idea of which one will work for me copy it, adapt it, change it sometimes so that code scanning will not go and redirect flag. <laughs> and then boom, off I go. So the thing is that the only difference is that it will just take lesser time for me to solve the problem most times than a junior developer. It's still the same problems with Google. <laughs>